Nobody should ever try to justify what happened that day on that video. Nobody. Nobody. News harsh words from the family at the center of a now viral video that shows Phoenix police accosting a family who was accused of shoplifting. A community meeting held tonight as emotions are at a breaking point for many. Phoenix Police Chief Jerry Williams vowing more meetings will follow and not backing down from angry community members. Real change doesn't start with the police department. Real change starts with our community. Chief Williams explaining that the police department is a part of the community that is trying to heal. This story trending on Twitter across the valley at this hour. The goal of that meeting was to bring the chief, the mayor, and community members together to create understanding and address concerns related to police and the public. You're getting live team coverage from inside that contentious meeting and what people are saying. We want to start now with Team 12's Nicole Zyman. Nicole? Yeah, guys, that meeting wrapping up just about an hour ago and Pilgrim's Rest Baptist Church was almost at full capacity. The fire marshal saying that some 2500 people were in attendance. Now the meeting at moments heated at moments impassioned with people urging for change and transparency. Emotions running high. Real change doesn't start with the police department. Real change starts with our community. Phoenix Police Chief Jerry Williams' message falling flat before she clarified. The police department is a part of this community. The, the community is a part of this police department. The meeting filled with many claiming their lives have been impacted by police brutality. This situation has changed my life dramatically. I don't have balance. Your officer took that away from me. No kids should see that. Including Dravon Ames, the man at the center of this now viral video. Get out the 12 News learning this is not Ames' first run in with officers. Ames now facing two felony charges for aggravated assault against police officers, stemming from a Halloween incident last year. Ames is now calling for change. It hurts to see that this is what happened when someone shoplifts or whatever, if you think it's about stealing or whatever. Others proposing answers. Number one, early warning systems. An early warning system is a database police management tool designed to identify officers whose behavior is problematic and provide a form of intervention. Many calling time and time again for transparency. We're here for a lack of trust, for a lack of transparency, and for a lack of accountability. Police Chief Jerry Williams taking everything in. As I, as we sit and listen tonight, I want to hear, I want to feel, I want to process what is being felt in this community so we can go back to the drawing board. The police chief promising this is not the last community meeting and Phoenix Mayor Kat Kate Gallego ending the meeting tonight saying that the city will now come up with a list of recommendations for the police department within the next 30 days. As for the two officers at the center of this incident, they have so far been placed on desk duty as the investigation continues. We're live in Phoenix, Nicole Zymack, 12 News.